Inside Science. What does our brain do best? Well, it finds meaning in our chaotic world. It sifts the information coming in from our senses, from the touch sensors in our fingertips to the taste sensors in our tongue to the fine inner ear hair cells that sense differences in pitch. And it tries to work out which of these are signal and which are just random noise. I mean, there is a constant river of data flooding into our brains all the time. And it's our brain's job to make sense of this. What has meaning and what doesn't? As you go up to increasing sophisticated brain regions, we gain increasing insights into our world. And with increasing insight comes an increased chance of survival. Take sight. The retina is searching for information as soon as light hits it. It's processing contrast. It's looking for edges in the noise. And those signals then move to the early visual cortex, which searches for shapes and movements in the scene. And at the highest stages of visual processing, our brains search for the most complex shapes we can recognize like faces in the brain's fusiform gyrus. From the simplest shapes to the subtlest social moments, our brain is constantly trying to work out what things have meaning and what things just don't. Even at a microscopic level, our brain cells are constantly either strengthening synapses that carry good information from other brain cells or letting synapses that carry only noise die. This is called synaptic pruning, and it's happening all the time in our brains. And it's the sum of all of these tiny decisions, is it noise, is it not, that make up our interpretation of the world. And when we finally have an interpretation of the world that we trust, at last, our brain can carry out its other major function, controlling the actions of our bodies. From walking, to talking, to touching. But our actions can only ever be as good as our insights allows them to be. For Inside Science, I'm Ali Jennings. Thanks for watching. Inside Science. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on the web and social media. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.